Hey guys, it's April Schluter of The Cheerful Mind, and I'm here to give you Monday's tip of the week. It is, what is today? It's going to be Monday, August 29th. By the time you see this video, it's the night before. I've actually had this pretty insane weekend of being lazy, and then my technology has been falling apart everywhere. So um, my iPhone's not working. I can't back it up. My computer's telling me I don't have enough space. It's been a little bit crazy, but I am here because I want to talk to you today about community. Um, I've been thinking a lot about community lately and, you know, becoming an entrepreneur and, and kind of moving from the working nine to five and whatnot to this type of lifestyle where you're running your own business has definitely been a change in terms of who I reach out to to be my community and I can say that it's been pretty lonely sometimes to not have the right support and you know I do have a ton of different communities I'm not saying that I don't have any friends anymore but things have definitely changed and I've been just thinking about you know where do I find this community for me um, and I just want to go back to kind of say, yes, I joined a business mastermind. So I have a group of 50 plus people who are also entrepreneurial coaches, healers, and consultants that are learning to grow their business. So I have a community there. Um, obviously, I was in Portland a couple weeks ago and found this whole amazing community of people. But of course, they're all over the world. So um, it's you know, a challenge to stay connected. Um, I've got my trapeze community. I've got, you know, my family as a community. Basically, a community is that group of people who is going to support you and lift you up. And these are the people who you can partner with on certain tasks. Um, these are the people that you can turn to when times get tough. Um, or the people that you can celebrate um, when things are awesome. Um, so I think I just wanted to talk a little bit about the importance of community. If you don't have a community, please go out and find those people who can be there for you. Because when you um, have a community behind you, you can accomplish so much more. I, I can't tell you how much I've been able to accomplish by just having people to bounce ideas off of and just people to support me when things have been absolutely crazy. Um, you know, in my business alone, you, you know, this event that I was just running the last month, I couldn't have done it without this amazing team behind me. Um, it was definitely not me by myself. So, you know, I definitely want to thank um, my support team there. Um, but even, you know, when things get tough in trapeze, I have to turn to my friends who've been seeing me do these tricks for months and months and, you know, to kind of keep me motivated and, and keep going. So just wanted to kind of talk about that importance. But if you're having trouble trying to figure out how to find and build your own kick booty community, um, I would just say, you know, start by, you know, finding the places where people have the similar interests as you people that might have the same values. Obviously, uh, my two big values that I like to talk about are, you know, people who like to accomplish things and people who love to have fun. So people who, you know, are these go-getters and, and fun people, these are the people I want to surround myself with. Um, as I mentioned, you can have more than one community. So if you are somebody like me who has a ton of different interests, go and find multiple communities because they can serve different purposes in your life. Um, and then another thing is to just maybe reach out to people that you admire. You know, I'm, I'm in the process of doing that and just really making sure that I'm surrounding myself with the people who are most important to me. Um, my friend Marley loves the, the challenge about how, you know, the five people you surround yourself with are, are basically a representation of who you are. And so make sure that the people that you are surrounding yourself with are amazing people who align with what you are interested in and what you love in your life. So I know this is kind of a little bit of a crazy video and I think my mind is, um, you know, traveling all over the place because I am really, really frustrated at my phone, but I did want to just kind of give you that pep talk about community. 
go out and find those people. They are out there. And if you feel like you're alone, trust me, you're not. I, I, you know, sometimes feel alone as well. So you're not alone. Um, come find me if you feel like you need communities. Send me an email, april at the cheerfulmind.com, and I will be there to support you. So I hope you have a fantastic week. I hope my phone gets fixed and my computer and my everything else. And I will talk to you soon. See you then.